Good morning, everyone. It's your friendly neighborhood coach, Dr. Wu, and I am listening. Beautiful sunrise. Just wanted to show, share the colors. Thought of the day is I will surround myself with people who are also following their dreams. Mm, ponder. You know, humans mirror each other. So, for seed to grow, it really needs safe, nourishing and rich soil environment. So as you're forming your dream team, it's gotta be a team of people that are also um, believe in the dreams and are dreaming together with you. Common path. Uh, so the action step is, yeah, who are the five people you're grateful for? That was yesterday's. But also today, who who is in your life is actually part of your dream team? And uh, if not yet, then how are you preparing to recognize your dream team when they come? When the members of the dream team come? So, yeah. And my heart goes out to the... We've lost two, two more ER physicians to suicide this week. So I've been uh, working on that project. Trying to get the word out. You know, I'm trying to compile a list of what are the 10 myths, you know? Let's debunk, you know, the resistance to burnout. And uh, uh, many people know they're burnt out, but they don't want to admit it because uh, they're going to be seen as uh, weak or selfish or lazy or, or maybe they'll lose their job. So, yeah, it's just a whole lot of judgment there. So I'm just uh, still compiling that list. As a matter of fact, if you've got some um, thoughts or feelings about burnout, like how does that feel? And uh, where is that resistance to seek help or to even admit you have burnout? Um, or do you even know what burnout is or the symptoms? So yeah, love your input because um, that's heavy on my heart. I want to help lift the burden um, for some people, right? The compassionate, courageous defenders that have been helping and serving other people for so many decades of their lives. No wonder they're exhausted. And uh, they've also faced some traumas and moral injuries from um, those environments that they've been serving in. So those are all setups for burnout and post-traumatic stress. And that does affect the brain. So, ah, so that's my why and that's my, my mission working on that but the action step who are the people that you're going to be on the lookout for to be part of your dream team and uh, who are you thankful for uh, to be around that they are supportive and you're supporting them they're supporting you in your dreams uh, be blessed we really are blessed and whatever blessing and comfort or skills we have learned we are now to bless others with it, with that skill, the comfort, and uh, the healing and the wholeness. So I declare healing and wholeness over you. Shalom, peace. Shalom, peace means everything mended, all the broken pieces put back together with God's golden love. Ah, shalom, peace. Look, the sun always rises. It's another beautiful day, a new day, a new beginning, a new fresh a new thought, a new emotion, a new idea, a new dream, a new dream team, new friends, new connections. Uh, it's Friendship Friday. Thank you for being my friend. Be blessed. And you are blessed. Shalom, peace. Shalom, peace. Oh, yeah, 530. I scheduled something on Facebook Live. We'll see how it works out. And I'll be talking about stress, turning stress into calm and peace, sharing the skills again. You are blessed.